I'm Gotaga, and welcome back to another Crackadrack Hammer of Grugni episode. Where, in the last episode, we found ourselves under attack by three Norskan armies. If we don't win this battle, I think we can safely say that the campaign is over. So, let's get right into it and see where our future lies. So, we have Thorgard. Promzen and his army, and the garrison from the settlement, but they are so poorly um, equipped, or they're, they're so beaten that they're not going to be any use to us whatsoever. And we are fighting one, two full armies, and a reserve army. It's all marauders. So that's going to be interesting, but I think just the number, just the, the sheer number of troops is going to be overwhelming. Now, we're not going to control a large army. We're going to, because these reinforcements are going to do us no good. But if we can get theirs to come in at a trickle, that will be better for us. So let's fight this battle. Welcome to the battlefield. So... Let's see, where shall we deploy? We want to try and use the terrain to our advantage. Last time that didn't quite work out. Do we want to corner camp? Well, if we do, it means they have to come further to get to me. Which is a good thing. Yes. Let's, let's set up camp right here. So... That's the back of the map. What's the back of the map down this side? Oh, we'd actually get a little bit of a hill. Actually, we'll do it down that side. Okay. Let's grab more quarrelers. And then grab another group of quarrelers. And let's grab our warriors. Grab our miners and the rest. Our cavalry and these warriors who are not really gonna do us much good. All right, let's grab everybody and oh no, <laughs> let's try that again. Let's grab everybody. And move them back to about there for now, and then we'll arrange them properly when they get there. Alright, so let's take our cavalry and we'll use them as a decoy over there. We should be able to outrun pretty much anything they have. Now that we, they do have a unit of the beasts of Tashna, some war beasts. That's probably the only thing they have that will be able to catch us. Let the vengeance begin. All right, let's set you guys up. Yeah, that's not exactly the best formation. Can we do that? Let's grab the second lot. Let's do that. Right. So, Warriors front line. Grab Miners on this side. Get the miners on this side. And then we want our Huskalas here. Get Thorgard comes in here. Actually, we might put him here. What do we have? An engineer missile specialist. He can go here. And these two guys are going to mean nothing, so. Let's just use them to reinforce the front here. Now. 
Okay. Alright, have they taken the bait? No, they haven't. Nobody's... Nobody's chasing... Oh no, they've got one unit coming after me. And that's their elite axe infantry. Let's go up here. Oh, excuse me. Alright, so they've got a war mammoth. That's going to prove interesting. Yeah, you might want to turn around, mate, and face the front. Alright, what do we have that we can help? Uh, expert charge defense. Wind spell. Regeneration. Okay, not too much. That's going to help. And our engineer, we have factual allies in range. May as well use that now. Plus 40% armor piercing. May as well use that now as well. Okay. Oh, use that breath attack. Alright, uh, let's get the people quarrelers at the back. Why didn't it select them? There we go. You attack that. And you help them. We have one target at the moment. And it's that bloody mouth. Uh, and you guys though, we do need additional troops there. Alright, we're going to bring them back. We're going to see if we can get them to come and charge in the rear of these units. Assuming my front line is still holding at that point. Oh, good. We've gotten rid of their mammoth. Just have... No, 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 no. Not you. You're not going to run right there. Alright, he's gone. He's gone. Excellent. Let's get... You guys attacking here, and the second group attacking here. What I could do with another unit to help. So let's bring the Huskalars over here. Alright, gonna bring them down. Gotta use these guys to just hold them up. They're not gonna be able to do much against them, but I don't care. That's not the point of them. An interesting question is, will we have enough missiles to to live out the battle? Alright, we're starting to, they're starting to crumble, and they're fleeing. So we might have survived the initial assault. Let's get this rear line to stop firing. Save some ammunition. Uh, what do we have here? Well, we've got Throg. And a Marauder Chieftain. Okay. And we have Miners and Miners. Okay, let's just... As we'll bring them down, right, you're going to go stop them and come down here. Okay. They're fleeing, so we have survived the first wave. So, Frog is going the wrong direction. Okay. Okay, they're gonna come. So they're not coming in uh, in a long drip formation. They're gonna actually form up and attack me as a wave. That's interesting. Uh, okay. Let's see if we can get these miners to just get into melee with you. I don't think that's gonna be happening. We want them to get into melee so that we can and charge into your sides. Boom. 
Come on. Come on, miners. You can run quicker than that. This is fun running in circles. All right, get around behind them, and we need to tell these guys that they are free to engage again. Come on, you don't have much time. Charge. Right, so they're coming forwards now. I need you guys further away. Alright, let's get back to the main battle. Get our engineer to buff our troops again. So our front line is concentrating on. Okay, he's a large target, that's okay. If you wouldn't mind helping out. Oh, yeah, actually, you can fire a frog. And you can all fire a frog as well. You're going to be fighting frog very soon. Alright, time to buff the troops. Now, uh, where are my cavalry? No, no. Okay. So the battle has commenced and a frog went over to the left. Well, let's make him pay for that decision. See if we can get him to leave. Oh, he's down. All right, excellent. Where is their lord? I think we killed the lord as well. The Huskars, I think, are going to be needed now on the left flank. Alright, where's my lord? Uh, where are you? Buff yourself. And let's let that loose. Oh, how did they manage to catch them? Come on. I need these spike gunners to get there quickly. Come on. Uh, they managed to catch our cavalry, it's a real problem. Come on, make them rout. Oh, there goes one unit. I think they're about to rat. That's good. We've got more troops coming. How are we going in the main battle? Okay, we're holding our own. Let's get these guys involved in the fight. Oh, I think our lord can help out by there. Let's get some more magic on them. So ammo is now starting to run low, so let's get these guys to halt firing so that we've got some reserves. 
Yeah, they are running for the most part. That's good. All right. Let's see if we can get these guys over to our battle lines. And here comes the third wave. Can we survive it? Perhaps we should reform our lines. Okay, yeah, we are looking a bit tattered here, so let's get these guys. The line there. Our scholars are going to be a main line of defense there now. Let's move these guys to the right flank. Bring the miners in a bit closer there. All right, so Thor, Thor God is going to have to lead our men through this final assault. They've done a good job thus far. Is that one of ours? Yes, it is. Let's get these guys all over here. The spike guns could actually prove useful. Let's get the cavalry. That bar there should do it. So, what are we facing? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 units. Let's reform. Okay, so our front line is ready and able to fire very soon. Now's the time. Okay, no more volleys on them. We should instead direct your volleys at that one. Don't know if these guys are going to be able to make it there in time. Okay. Take your fire and place it on that unit. Alright, so their main, their main force is now coming at us. Time to buff our troops once again. And until the second line, they can open fire. Use this on them. Right through the middle, hopefully. There we go. Alright, buff yourself up, mate. You give yourself some extra health. And why not? Let's throw in the leadership, too. Alright, let's get those miners to charge into them. Get my cavalry in the back of them. Oh, they're already... Oh, yep, they're about to flee. Excellent. Battle well fought, my boys. Battle well fought. A heroic victory. Well fought. Some much-needed gold. I'll certainly take that. Uh, did we lose anybody? No, uh, we managed to keep our entire force intact. And we did inflict casualties upon them, but most of their troops are still there. So most of them fled. Uh, let's see, what do we want? No, we need the casualty replenishment, so let's just take the leadership. Okay, so one of their armies disappeared. Oh, so, now, if we leave the Eisteraic Fjord, then that rebel army is going to attack. Rebellion in the Ice Tooth Mountains. Where is that? 
Oh, that's that rebel army there, okay. Alright, uh, well we can take them out. My axe for war. Or do we want to finish off them? Let's just give him his upgrade. Uh, what do we want? Charge bonus for the army? Sure. Um, what else can he take? When in Norska, income from raiding. We're not doing much of that at the moment. So that's, again, anti-ambush. Speed for him. Uh, let's give him some more leadership. Why not? And the engineer. Um, that's for towers. No. More speed. That's leadership. What's the extra powder? Okay. Um, what can we give them? Tentacle enhancements. That's just for him. Let's boost the income. We need the income. Oh, he's still got some more. Well, let's boost the income some more. Um, and then give him... Increased mobility. Why not? Okay. Do we go left, or do we go right? If we go left... Well, we'd destroy them, but then they have a chance of getting away. But we we'll, we can defeat them again. If we don't wipe these out now, they'll probably take out the Ice Drake Fjord. We can't afford to lose that. So let's destroy this rebel army. And I'll take the cash, please. Oh, it's only a little bit. How much extra would we get? Another 365... No, let's see if we can get the... No, let's take the money. Beards and belts. Now, what is that? An uncharted island. We search with a lord. There's a chance we could get money out of that, but our army's a bit battered, so... Let's just return back to here. Oh, we could still reach the others on this turn. Ooh, that might be well worth it. Uh, Alright, what upgrades? Construction cost reduction for him and the other character. Let's just increase his leadership aura. Okay. So the Asteroid Fjord. Alright, we won't go for that quite My yet, but let's let's so attack that army. Excellent. Wipe them out. This time we'll take the replenishment. It is time. So we can't make it to their army, but we can make it back Whoa. to the Asterix Fjord. Yes. So we're not going to take any attrition. Excellent. And once again, we can upgrade our Lord. And what do we want to go for? Plus four melee defense, four long beards. We're probably going to start, if we can, investing in long beards pretty soon. Ammunition for bolt throwers. Ammunition for spike gunners. What's the second one give us? Missile strength. Let's go for that one, because we're getting some spike gunners in our garrisons. And I would like to get some spike gunners into the army, eventually. Uh, well, so we're earning a bit of cash. That's nice. Now let's go over and see how Cracker Drac is holding up. So, 14 turns before surrender. Okay. But we're dwarfs. We shall not surrender. Uh, how are we going for our time on this? Four turns remaining. Okay. Our uh, damage building. I'm not going to repair that. So let's just end the turn. Taking a while. Stuff snatchers. I wonder where they are. 
Confederation, Yatane and Avalon. Okay, so the High Elves. Teotiqua has been destroyed. I wonder by whom. Sword of Cain has been claimed by... don't know. Okay. Alright, that army seems to have an additional unit, which they didn't have earlier. The Empire up there, I still haven't seen this second. The Vermin Hull is on fire, I wonder who's attacking them. My guess would be Ostland. Or perhaps the uh, Reichland. Uh, Reich, you bugger, Reichland's moved into these territories I was claiming. Okay, um, how are we? Okay, we've got some of our troops back. Do we have enough to take this? We do. I think we can. I think we can take that. Let's attack. Strike while I on top. No, he's run off. Yeah, okay, you can run away. Oh, okay, I'm gonna take your settlement. So that's a victory. A little bit more gold, which is much needed. And I'm just gonna occupy. Which gives us a province. It's been quite rare in this campaign that I've had a province. Let's go for the growth. Okay, so no, are we able to reach no there? No, we're not. Okay. Guess we're staying in the settlement for a moment. And let's go for. Hmm. Overseer and. Ah, Sapper. Don't really mind what I get for that guy at the moment. Um. Okay. Do I have the money to repair this now? Yes, let's do so. I'm not going to bother building anything here yet. Okay, so the Doom Keep is the other one I have. Okay, excellent. What's minus 12 per turn? But that income is the only thing keeping us afloat. Alright, so let's end the turn. Now, if I can wipe out that army on the following turn, that will be the end of that faction, I believe. And then we'll move north. Well, actually, no. Then we'll then we'll take our army back to Ice Drake Fjord and rest up, and then perhaps go out for that island. If that could give us some gold, then that would be very handy. Oh, they've decided to attack. Okay. They're, they're a loss. Oh, he's still running. Oh, I'm actually going to have to go out after him. That's annoying. Oh, he is a character. I wonder if my character could just kill him. What options do I have? No, I can only block him. Alright, that's not... No good. Um... My army's pretty much intact there. Could go out to that right now. Confident defender. What is the garrison here like? Would they be able to take him on? Well, they should be able to. He's got 498 health. I don't see how he alone can win that battle. So, we will move our troops out to the island and see what is on there. Alright, let's go for the Troll Hunters for him there. And then take... What do we want to take? What shall we take? Oh, sorry for the traffic there. Let's increase his leadership. Size aura. Or aura size, however you want to say it. And let's get the extra powder. And... Let's Give him a little bit more health. My okay. For war. Yep, we're going to risk it. We're going nation. to go out and we're going to see what we find. Your army will perform better in battle. Your army will perform better on campaign. Okay, not what I was hoping for. Shrine of War will fill back your army's momentum. shall quicken. 
Warriors enter insatiable frenzy. It gives them a the shrug of injury in this state. Let's take the campaign bonus. Oh, some gold. Excellent. And campaign movement plus 25% for 10 turns. Excellent. Ready. I think that was worth it. Alright, so. Let's see. What do we want to take? Um... Oh, can we actually build... Oh, it provides a garrison. Grudge throws, dwarf warriors, and quarrelers. Okay. And we'll generate an extra 100. Which will be handy, so let's just take that. And then this should be very close to ending. Two turns remain. Okay. In the turn. So we're hanging on by the skin of our teeth financially, but we have eliminated, well, practically eliminated our um, enemy. But we do have chaos and throg, a uh, throt rather, throt on the uh, the eastern side of our territories. We might send this army back to take care of that. And where's he gone? Interesting. Chaos, no, I'm not going to grant the request for Chaos Corruption everywhere. There's way too much of that stuff as it is. Um, where do we want to go? Let's, let's go over to the Longship Graveyard. Okay. Actually, can I build something that's going to give me some additional... Uh, well, it's untainted, that would be nice. Some additional public order. That's what I want. Because the moment we leave here, we're going to start to bleed public order. Well, perhaps I should see how much we lose. Because that might not even cover it. Yep. We'll wait a turn. However, what cannot wait a turn is finding out what's happening over here. The Kricken, uh, Cracker Hidden Nook can be upgraded. I'm not going to do that yet. I'm going to wait till I've got troops there. Aha! Reichland did take the Vermin Held. Okay. Interesting. And Reichland are at war with the Iceling. Uh, Iceling. Okay, we continue to... Okay, it looks like we're taking some casualties now. But if they want that, they're going to have to attack my settlement. I'm not going to rally, uh, go out there just yet. Let's um, replenish this. And go for the next turn. Really want that Chaos Army to attack me. If they attack me, we can definitely take them. If they continue to just drain my forces, well. Aha, they are attacking me. So what do they have? They have some Chosen with great weapons, some Chosen, Chaos Warriors, more Chaos Warriors, Aspiring Champions, and Chaos Giant. What do we have? So... This is our army that's stationed there, so not much. But our garrison is pretty decent, I think. Some longbeards. Some spike gunners. Catapult. Yes, okay, this is going to go. So they don't have reinforcements, so we may as well control the large army. So let's see how this goes out. Okay, here we are on the battle map, and... It's very misty. I'm not quite sure why it's so misty. Now, let's reposition our troops. Where is the town square? Okay, by there. So let's just take everybody and dump them in here for the moment. So we can sort them out. Yeah, like so. Okay. First things first, let's set up this catapult. Do they have a siege? 
No, they don't. Okay. So let's place... Now, where they've placed their army mostly on the right. So let's place our siege equipment over here. Where we can actually reach the map more easily. Then let's go for some longbeards at the, the front. Maybe we'll actually grab one of the longbeards with great weapons as well. There we go. So we've got those guys there. Let's get the spike gunners to back them up from the top of the hill so we can shoot over them. And group them up. And let's get our quarrelers and put them into a single group. And let's put them up to the top. So we're kind of betting that they're all going to come through from this direction. So who do we want on the battlements? Well, we've got some quarrelers with great weapons. Let's put them here and here. And then let's use miners for that. And that one might be able to hit the targets there. I don't know. Okay. Maybe we'll just move these corners to over here, actually. And use that third unit of miners to hold this. Okay, what do we want? That's our lord, so he can... Go here, do we have an engineer? No, no engineer with this group. Okay. Let's keep our lord in the town square here. Uh, who's going to join him? Um, let's give him long some long beards. Okay. And he can also have a thane with him. The Grom Bakras. Okay, let's put them at the bottom by here. And let's take these Huskalas. They can help out over here. I'm pretty sure. Maybe... Maybe in front of the... The spike gunners, yep. Okay, and then we've got another Thane, and he'll be out here. I think that's everybody. Yes, that's everybody. Okay, let's start the battle. Let's see what they try to do. Now we want to aim, if we can, at that Chaos Giant. That's our priority. Oh, they do have Siege. Oh no, that was a magic spell. Okay. I'm not too fussed about these towers. Though, that said. That said, we might want to get some troops um, to back them up. The miners, I think, will pull back to that part. And the corollas as well. But they'll come through the back. Okay, so we've got our two groups of corollas who've opened fire. What are they firing upon? Chaos Warriors. Okay. You think you can take them down? So this is still able to fire at that. That's good. Are you able to fire at him? No, he's out of range. Now, how about our catapult? Can that fire at him? Yes, it can. Okay, time to pull back these guys. So let's pull them back. And pull them back. Let's just get a few more shots on him. Okay, now you guys are off the battlements. And you're meant to be getting off as well. Come on. Alright. Let's get the miners and put them by there. Now, where did those two groups of... Well, let's go. There's one. There's another. Didn't group them. Ok. 
Okay, now we've got them grouped. So let's get them back here. So if we get them running along the wall, then they're probably going to get assaulted. We don't want that, because they're already on the walls. Done. What's taking these guys so long? Get off the walls. Alright, so they're coming directly for here. Alright. Not unexpected, I suppose. Let's get you down that way. Let's get Thane forwards as well. Alright, where are these quarrelers? Come on, you're taking forever. You have no excuse for taking so long. Okay, so the spike gunners have laid into them. That's good. They're going to be trying to run for it. Can't really go anywhere at the moment. Catapult is... I'm not going to fire at all these targets. Let's just fire at the thing at the back. That's interesting that the warriors are just sitting there and must be waiting for reinforcements. Let's pull these miners back. Oh no, they're going in now. Alright. Let's let them do their charge and we'll stop their charge with our Thane. Buff himself up. Okay, you stop them. Now you're going to go after them, and you're going to go after them, and we're going to bring you guys in from the rear. Come on, hurry up, you stunty little legs. You're missing out on the action. In you go. Some armor piercing in the back. Okay, how are we going here? Things are going okay. Now let's grab these spike gunners and see if we can inflict some damage on their lord. And let's do the same with the crawlers. Why not? Those miners are a lost cause, but that's fine. They're just miners. Let's um, start firing into the group. Come on, catapults. Uh, good, the Lord is down. And they're running the gauntlet. They're just trying to run past our troops. Not really interested in fighting them at the moment, by the looks. Oh, here they come. Alright. Now, who are these? These are the chosen. Okay. Let's to attack them at all. It looks like they're just gonna they're gonna run. Let's charge into them. So we can break them. There they go. Right, let's get you guys up on the walls. Get on the walls, then at least we'll be able to fire at them. They've run for it as well. Okay, we might as well just end the battle there, I think. I think we've inflicted a lot of casualties. Hopefully enough to uh, make them disappear from the campaign. Welcome back to the campaign. We have our close victory and much needed loot. So we managed to kill their lord and four units. Is that going to be enough for them to evaporate. We didn't take too many casualties there, so let's take the money. Oh no, he's sticking around. Welcome, men of the Empire. Non-aggression pact, okay, why not? Marienburg. How fares the Ostland. Like non aggression pact. Okay. Why not? Uh, 
Okay, so how did things turn out? So they have a new lord, Kuhar, and their chosen and the two chosen units survived, so they're going to be reviving. Unfortunately, my small army is not capable of rallying out and taking them on. So we're going to have to stay hidden in our hold until reinforcements arrive. So what would we like? Um, casualty replenishment would be nice. Yeah, let's go for the casualty replenishment. Okay. And for our other character. And what did he get? Let's give him additional hit points and additional melee defense. Okay, nice. Uh, Cracker Drag. We can upgrade to extra income, so 150 extra per turn. I don't know that that's worth that. Something to look at in the future. Let's have a look over here. I think our funds are probably better spent to in the, in our western province. Perhaps upgrading the Doom Keep and such. So that's me if you dare. We're going to move our army out to the east. For the wisdom of Valaya. See if we can hunt down. There he is. We want to hunt him down. So we'll just place ourselves off the coast. And now we can see how much we're losing per turn. We're losing four per turn. So if we do build the public order, yep, that will give us five per turn. So I think that's worth building in that region. And what can we do here? We can upgrade, but we'll leave that for the moment. So, so we fought two battles in this episode. Um, we will wrap things up here, I think. It's a good spot to do so. So, once more, thank you for uh, joining me here in this playthrough. Um, once again, I think I've just managed to scrape through by the skin of my teeth. But it should be interesting to see how things unfold from here. I'd like to give a big shout out to my patrons. Thanks to Hot Apple Pie. Cody Bonds, Alexander, and Solareth Magnetar. Your support is very much appreciated. I'm Grey Tiger, and I'll see you in the next video.